Good morning, world. I am Dr. Pete, and I am the host of All Things Keto, along with my daughter, uh, Tanner, who's uh, not here today. The purpose of this video is to uh, provide you a reproduced version of a, a pre presentation that I did yesterday. I was the featured presenter for the Heads Up Health Mastermind this month, and the topic of discussion was their Heads Up Health app, which is the most advanced biomarker app on the market. And why would I be talking to them about their app? It's because my health coaching company and the health coaching that I do is dependent on integrating this app into our practice. And the reason that we do it is because it allows a way for our clients to enter their bio biomarkers in the front end of the app and then in the back end of the app, as the health coach, I'm able to look at those biomarkers. And it what it does is it allows a much more intimate conversation between me, the health coach, and you, the client, so that we can make intelligent decisions about uh, the foods that you're eating and so on in the keto lifestyle. Um, there are other, very quickly, there are other strategies we use in our program to, to, to provide the, the highest quality coaching experience that, that is out there for our clients so that we, we utilize Marco Polo, for example, so that literally the client and I can be going back and forth in video messaging um, in, a, in a video messaging way um, rapidly. We use the Heads Up Health uh, app in order to manage the biomarkers and, and be able to make instantaneous decisions about your lifestyle. We also provide a free online course. If you sign up for our premier program, we have an ebook and uh, we have video tutorials that we deliver to you to personalize the program. Uh, there's a lot of things that we do. Um, the other thing that I want to say before I let you drift into the major part of the presentation uh, is to let you know that we just released our first online course in collaboration with the Nutrition Network. This course titled, How Do I Start and Maintain the Keto Lifestyle, is the first of its kind for online courses because it basically has nearly eight hours of video tutorials in it and it explains everything that you need to know about starting the ketogenic diet and then maintaining it as a lifestyle. So look below because I'm gonna provide you a code. It's 100KRHUNN. And if you sign up for the course and input that code, you get $100 off the course, you get a free month of one-on-one -on -one coaching with me, and you get one year access to the biomarker, uh, Heads Up Health biomarker uh, app. So look for the link in, of the course below, and any other information that you need uh, from Ketonic Revolution will also be there, other links to our blog and so on, our webpage. Any questions you have, uh, fire off an email to ketonicrevolution at gmail.com um, and we can set up a free Zoom session so that we can discuss you know, what your metabolic issues are and whether or not Ketonic Revolution can help you. All right, and with that, we're gonna go ahead now and segue to the mastermind presentation that I gave yesterday uh, with Heads Up Health. If you wanna give people a little overview first around around your your work i think and uh that'll be helpful for for context okay so yeah my name is dr pete and uh i started a, a company along with my daughter tanner uh approximately a year ago and our mission is to help people uh reverse type 2 diabetes obesity and cardiovascular disease using the ketogenic diet uh it, it, it's a it's a comprehensive uh health coaching company. So I'm not a medical doctor. I have a PhD in biochemistry and then uh, I'm a certified health coach with, a, with actually quite a few additional certifications through the nutrition network. And, um, and what I was going to talk to you guys about today is how we use the Heads Up Health app in our coaching. And I was lucky to meet uh, Dave at the Metabolic Conference 2020, just before COVID uh, struck its mighty hand down on us. And I think TJ was there too, wasn't he? 
I was. Yeah, <laughs> maybe I met TJ there too. I'm trying to remember exactly. That was um, my last I, business travel, which was February of 2000 of this year. It's amazing, Peter. That was the last time I was at a conference. Yeah, well, I'm really hungry to go to more. It was the last one for me too. Um, but I feel very fortunate to have been able to tie in with you guys because uh, I, I originally, um, and this was a while ago, I'm well nearly two years ago, I was pre-diabetic and I was, uh, I came on to the ketogenic diet uh, sort of ac accidentally and that is what sort of drove my passion uh, to master this area and, and try to be a bridge between uh, the doctors and the chronic disease and being able to reverse it. So, uh, and I was fortunate to meet you guys uh, because I, I had also to, to also divulge, I was a Verta patient for, for a while. And I knew to do this, that we needed an app. And uh, in order for my clients to be able to log their data, and, but, but also as importantly for me to be able to monitor their data as well. And, and I'm not brilliant with code or anything like that. So I knew I couldn't do it myself. And, and then I stumbled on you guys at that conference and I just was like, oh, mana from heaven, you know? So I'm very happy to be an early adapter. Um, just to give you a little bit of background, uh, I'm also a 28 year uh, veteran teacher of chemistry uh, of all levels and grades. And so the first thing that I wanted to do is to figure out uh, the best way to teach someone how to do this, because I, I'm certain you guys spend a lot of time on Facebook looking at the various forums uh, as part of the marketing. And, uh, you know, every day you see people posting, well, you know, my sugars were 500 this morning. I need to go on this diet. How do I do it? And so I I'm trying to address that. And so I, I've broken the diet down into uh, an acronym I call makes me healthy. And, um, and I don't want to get lost in this because I want to focus literally on what you guys do for us. But the M is for metering. I, I don't have to preach to any of the, I, I'm, I mean, I'm preaching to the choir here. Um, we all know that metrics are super important. Now you don't, what you don't know, you don't know. So if you're trying to make a lifestyle change, you've got to have some data. Um, the A in makes me is for, basically it's for your app. But in, in respect to those of us that are a lot older, for some, some of these guys, they're going to be writing in log books. Um, K is for keto. That basically is the foods that you can eat, the things that have to be avoided, and then everything that goes along with that from electrolytes down to uh, determining how much protein that, that you should be eating uh, each day. And then the last three letters, S, M, and E, which are about 20% of this, right? 80% of it is in the diet change. And then the rest of it boils down into the sleep patterns, uh, reduction of stress, and you know, their level of exercise. And we try, we, when we work with our clients, we do it holistically. We're looking at the whole program. And I should mention before I get to your part of it, that um, the people that we work with are, are, they have serious chronic issues, serious type two diabetes and serious cardio, cardiovascular disease. So they're pretty sick. And, uh, and so modulating the diet is one of the, uh, hardest parts of this and generally boils down to uh, maybe some of the other participants can comment on this later uh, down into the food habits and, and um, food addictions and things like that. So we have what I consider an elegant solution. It's simple to follow, easy to learn. The hardest part of health coaching people that are in this category or niche are the addiction issues. And I'm challenged by that. I'll tell you that right now. So the metering, this is just to indicate, first, we've got to have numbers. And you're just looking at my meters, my uh, average, well, my ketones particular morning. And uh, like I said, I reverse uh, prediabetes. I'm also hyperuricemic. So the yellow meter is where my, uh, was my uric acid that particular morning. And then you can see my fasting glucose. So all of this 
uh, goes into the app. And uh, in terms of the heads up stuff that this is just a brilliant app. Um, first off, let me say, you know, one of the challenges with clients is getting them to be willing to enter data. All right, I'm not gonna hide from that. It's true, it's, it can be a challenge. And what I like about this is that uh, the app is completely flexible. You can basically, you know, put in there a, a bare minimum if needed. And I advocate really heavily for four, four markers, uh, weight, blood glucose, ketones, and blood pressure as a minimum. But as you guys know, there's a lot of other things that this app will do. But the crucial thing is, Every single morning, I'm usually up at 4 a.m. and then I'm analyzing client data that either came in the next day. Um, and I'm gonna get to this in a second, but this isn't something that I thought about when I ran into Dave and I guess TJ at the conference, but use of this app and a few other things I'm gonna get into, uh, it increased the possibility of getting clients that are not local. Like when I got into this, I'm thinking, all right, my, my client base is gonna be Phoenix, Arizona, and that's gonna be it, right? But actually, most of our clients are out of state and we have clients now, uh, I just was interacting with one of them this morning who is in Australia. So like this dramatically increased my whole perception of who I can help because honestly, for me, this comes from the heart and I have an interest in ha having an impact on a worldwide basis as much as a single person can, but, but the Heads, Heads Up Health app gives us a way to do that because they can enter their numbers anywhere. They don't have to be here in Phoenix to do that. Um, and then shown on the right part of the screen, this is again, this is my data, so I'm not giving up any client stuff. Uh, it's just my ketone and blood glucose data over the last week. And, Looks pretty um, good, Peter. Yeah, you can see how it, it it's coming into a real tight line right there. <laughs> <laughs> so, and this is the thing, and I think anyone who's coaching out there who's worth their salt knows what I mean by this. I mean, you you pay attention to individual results that you see, you know, when you open up your client data, but very quickly I'm actually looking at the trends. And that's the thing about this app. You can call up graphing right away and you can put more than, obviously, as you can see on this screen, you can put more than one thing on there. And, uh, and, and I can see, you know, because there's gonna be a lot of scatter and I can see in the trend, you know, whether we're still going in the right direction or not. And then the other thing is when the clients kind of get down on themselves a little bit, cause like I said, I work with some type twos that are pretty heavy duty uh, into the disease. And when they have a bad day, I can, uh, I can interface with them and show them the trend and go, look, dude, it's just one point that's up here right now. This is not about one day. It's about what's going to happen over the, the next years. That's what matters. And look at your trend. Look which way the line is going. And it's going where it's supposed to be going, which is down if we're talking about the blood glucose and their ketones. I'm like, look at those ketones going up. So, you know, you're doing a great job. It's a way of a uh, really good way of picking them up. And it's a really good way for me to analyze, you know, the trends or what matter here. So the fundamental components of my program are the one one on one remote coaching. And uh, I don't want to segue away from heads up, but going into this uh, something else that I've learned that maybe other people could benefit here from was I figured going into this, I was going to be uh, zooming and texting, right? But I, uh, for, for a reason it had nothing to do with my efforts here, uh, it, it was my wife actually who brought to my attention this app called Marco Polo. And her and her sisters were going back and forth all the time. And so I immediately tried it with my clients. I got to tell you guys, they love it because it's pretty damn close to having a conversation with somebody. It's really personal and it's fairly instantaneous. When, when you're both in places where there's not a lot of distraction, I can video message them. They video message right back. And it's like I said, it's pretty close to uh, 
uh, to an actual conversation and they really like it and it works around the world. And so for me, Marco Polo, along with the Heads Up app, it's just killer what it's done for my ability as a coach and the clients absolutely so far, they love it. I haven't had one yet that, you know, got back to me and said, we got to, we have to zoom, right? They prefer this method. It's not that I don't offer the zoom. They prefer this. When I say zoom, they're like, no, Marco's working great. So that's pretty awesome, Peter. That is really, really cool stuff. Just, just the way that you're able to use that for, off asynchronous communication, but not just chat, but also a video message. Like how personal is that? Just when you got a minute to just be in a quiet place and send a nice little check-in video to a client or give them some encouragement uh, and wrap it, tie it back to the numbers where appropriate. But that just sounds like such a wonderful way to communicate with. Yeah, it with works really great. And I'm glad you jumped in because it made me slow down. And the, I, I wanted to say that I definitely want to be one of your early adopters of the wet notes because just this morning I was having an exchange with one of my clients who's type two and I was thinking there was something that that I wanted to bring up to him that we had discussed uh, uh, three months ago and I'm like crap how do I do that right now I, ha I would have needed to you know reach for a notebook and whatnot and um, and I knew I was going to have to flip through back notes and so I think this wet notes thing, I'm really looking forward uh, to having access to that because I, I'm going to be able to make notes uh, even during the Marco Polos. And, and then when, when I need to come back, I think that's hugely powerful and really thank you for coming up with that. Um, the other, okay, go ahead. No, uh, all good. Uh, the other aspects of what we do, we just completed uh, the preparation of an online course in collaboration with uh, Nutrition Network. And so we've brought that in as part of our program. We have an ebook that's part of this that they get right away when they sign up. And then quite often when I'm working with a client, if they need some, some kind of suggestion, uh, my client Australia wanted some suggestions about um, movement protocols or how, hits. And so I literally, you know, went to guns on making her some videos. Uh, and then I send her, you know, the links. So we do video tutorials too. And then obviously we save uh, that stuff goes onto a YouTube channel. So once we've done that work, then we have it available for other clients as well. So uh, the last thing I want to say about the heads up app, what it's done for us is that it's provided a, a full integration between what I do and the health coach. I mean, you know, COVID has done a lot of things that are bad for us, but I think in some ways it's really helped advance our ability to work with people. And, you know, if you, I, I read extensively on health coaching books that have been written a decade ago, and most of it is people sitting in a room with a client. If we had to do things that way, it, we're way less effective, right? How often are you gonna sit down with a client? And there's no chance that I would be able to work with someone else in Australia. So the Heads Up app is like, it allows a fully integrated uh, health coach relationship. And it's allowed me to branch out to clients that on a national level, instead of being just focused on my where I live. And the international thing, uh, is really exciting for me. I want to be able to interact with people now all around the world and I'm working hard on that aspect of it. So uh, I didn't want to go on for uh, forever with this. I just wanted to keep things concise. So that's basically my uh, presentation. Hey, Peter, just wanted to jump in real fast and, and kind of piggyback off what you just said about, you know, the benefits of COVID if there are any. Um, so I run a telemedicine company. And so I've been doing telemedicine, web-based uh, medicine for four to five years. I would say, you know, once COVID started, the, the hardest part for a lot of people doing medicine over video or chat um, has been just to adopt a change in perception of what that could actually entail. And so I think you've seen a huge push in the traditional medicine world to to implement some sort of video or telephone conferencing for for health related stuff so if anything i think right now there's a huge advantage for people who are looking to get into a space and expand 
their reach, as Peter mentioned, you know, it's not just uh, localized healthcare or uh, health coaching. I mean, this can be something global for a lot of people and your ability to reach different parts of the world where now it's more accepted to have this type of interaction. And now is a really good time to, to really jump on that bandwagon because I think a barrier has been broken in a sense where people have now uh, accepted that this is a new normalcy for us to some degree. And who knows how long it's going to be until we go back to some sort of normal world. Um, so, I mean, taking an app like Peter mentioned or Zoom plus Heads Up Health is, is I think, going to be a great way going forward um, to, to taking advantage of the space.